Hey yo, it's your boy, man, the PLK. You're now tuning in to VladTV.com, boy. Yeah. The, the whole whole shooting thing that happened that you mentioned early on. Never really heard you talk about it before. What what really what were the circumstances around this since this happened so long ago? Like, what can you really say? Oh, uh, just um where were you at the time? Um actually uh, I think this is around um uh, 50 Cent of the Future, the first mixtape. This is in the South Jamaica, Queens. Um, just going, you know, going to the nightclub still, you know what I mean? Like, when we would come back and forth um, from the studio, whatever we was doing, you know, um, 50 would be doing whatever he's doing, and, you know what I mean? I was younger, I'm still running around, you know what I mean? And, and going to the clubs and block parties and just being out there, you know what I mean? Like I said, um, you... you Sometimes you surpass other people's expectations before your own. You don't feel like you're that big, but you out there, and you know what I mean? I can't even call it like a, um, a a personal thing. It was just something that happens when you're there. When you're outside the nightclub and the club let out, it's only a few things that can happen. It's either gonna be a good night or a bad night. You either gonna witness it or you're gonna be a part of it, you feel me? And then that night I was a part of it. Um, and it was just something you know, that, that, that boom, knocks you back on your feet and put me back in the studio opposed to hanging out in the nightclub every night. Where'd you get shot? Um, in my stomach, my back, man. You got shot in the back? Yeah. It went through your stomach? Yeah. Grazed a couple of times. Really? Yeah. You ended up in the hospital? I, mean, I had to run to the hospital. It wasn't like the, the movies where you just, oh, you know what I mean? Like, I had to, oh shit, I'm fucked up. And I had to run all the way um, from Jamaica Avenue to Mary Mack Hospital. Did you think that you were gonna die that night? Um, you know, of course that that I was hurt pretty bad. You know what I mean? Um, like the basically said, if I would have got there a couple minutes later, I could have, you know, died from blood loss. You know what I mean? But um, but I felt like it wasn't over for me. You know what I mean? Like that's why I kept saying, like, man, just stitch my shit up, let me go. You know what I mean? I gotta. We about to go on tour. You feel what I'm saying? So I just felt like I wasn't, nah, not at that time. Is there a significant change in your life after that? Um, yeah, of course. You, you know, um, it gives you a third eye. You know what I'm saying? Um, little things that that somebody else might see and not pay attention to, you know, yeah. it stays there. Like, I'm, a, you know, I see it. Oh, I see you, nigga. You know what I mean? Like, you know, more aware surroundings. A little extra awareness, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Um, not saying I wasn't aware before, but shit hurt. You know what I'm saying? Like I, I, I know what it feel like, and I ain't trying to feel that again. So, do you still feel it? Uh, yeah. Then I got like a lot of dead nerves. Yeah. You know, due to that. Um, I was told that you know some will go away. Sometimes they never go away. You know what I'm saying? But uh, yeah, I got a reminder that, and the scars are enough. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But you, you know, you patch it up and you get back going.